What's up everyone? Here in Chinatown again on a beautiful Sunday evening. It's 83 Fahrenheit, 28 Celsius. The 15th of September, 2022. We're at the East Broadway section at Catherine Street. Chatham Square is right over there. But I'm not gonna be doing this walk alone today. I've got two friends with me, you might know them. Hi. Welcome back, Kenneth. We're so excited. Oh, is that Action Kid? <gasps> Whoa. <Kenneth. laughs> That's me. Yep. It's Ben and Ming from the Bing Buzz. They've got their own YouTube channel. Go check them out. We're so excited to walk Chinatown. We love I know. Chinatown. It's I know. been like a couple of weeks. I can't believe we haven't done like a dedicated video of Chinatown just that is true. walking. That's yeah. true. That's true. Yep. Yeah. Where, should, where do you want to go? Where do you want to Let's go to. That way. Okay, that Shout way. out to yeah. Golden Unicorn. It's voted the best dim sum spot in Chinatown. It is? I, I thought it was Jing Pong. Our local favorite video. Oh, oh yeah. Jing Pong got moved, so oh. it's not the same anymore. Okay. Yeah. yeah, that's right. You also do the uh, What Should You Eat in Chinatown video by yeah. locals. Yeah. Well, so any neighborhood, really. Yeah. Okay. All right. They do a lot of uh, food vlogs, much more than I do. That is not true, Kenneth. Yeah. You do a lot. I do I do, <laughs> do a lot. <laughs> Jing Fong got moved, that's right. This is it's a much smaller location now. Mm -hmm. I haven't tried out the new location yet. I haven't either. No one when we did the interviews in Chinatown, no one really mentioned Jing Fong because it closed during that time. Oh, okay. So you gotta do a new one. Yeah, we should. You should. We've been asking people about uh, what's your favorite place to eat in Chinatown, but um, haven't heard Jing Fong yet, actually. You should do what you should eat in Chinatown, updated 2022 version. Yeah, yeah Chinatown, yeah. I feel like it's like every couple months you got to do a new one. I know. It changes so fast. That's good. You could just change the date and say updated version. <laughs> <laughs> Same thing applies to Flushing, too. Yeah, that's right. I still haven't even been back to Flushing in a while. Oh. Yeah. I gotta take a look. I love Flushing. I'm going there Wednesday. I'm going there for a wedding. Oh, nice. Yeah. I love it when the weddings are in Flushing. And then we'll be back on Thursday for our birthday. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice. For in Chinatown. Chinatown. <laughs> I love when the weddings are in Flushing because the food is so good and it's close because we're in Queens. <laughs> you know, I've never attended a wedding in Flushing. It's always been Manhattan, Chinatown. Uh, yeah. Or, or how about Brooklyn? Brooklyn, never. Uh, I've, I've attended a funeral in uh, Flushing. Oh, yes. But never a wedding. Dang. It's such nice weather today for outdoor eating. It is. Last, last week was pretty cold. This is so nice. It brings back nostalgic memories. I remember in the cold weather they still had those like wooden shacks here. Yeah. It was pretty cool when they had that. <laughs> this street is so iconic. What's your favorite place to eat from here? Like from this street? Or? Yeah, this street, Doyers. Oh man, I like. I like that place, tasty hand cooked noodles. Yeah, tastes good. <laughs> That's mm -hmm. good. Taiwan pork chop house is good too. Yeah. Let's see what uh, what other options are there. But yeah. that handful noodle place is good. <laughs> I like Taiwan pork chop house yeah. for the desserts. Ooh. They do a good job with it. Especially the mango ice and all those. They give you like that big tapioca burl. Yes, that sounds so All good. All to eat. This place is like super fancy inside. Peachy. It's like a Manhattan restaurant, fancy Asian restaurant. Oh yeah. Cocktail bar? Yeah. Oh, haven't tried that one yet. And there's a speakeasy where the chemist is. It's <laughs> so ah. hidden. Whoa, where's Not the line? Tea parlor. Pro tip, if you come in the late afternoon or evening, the line isn't that long for Nanghua. 
Maybe Usually it's not dim sum hours anymore. It's not, yeah, that's true. Fun. Usually the line's like pretty long for that one. Yeah. I don't know about you, but I kind of feel like Chinatown's becoming more of like a late night spot now. Oh. Yeah. yeah. I'm glad that it opens late. So yeah. Fun. That's true. All the speakeasy is in Chinatown now. Mm -hmm. And in Flushing, everything kind of closed early. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I know especially like early like 2020, early 2021, Chinatown closed really early. True. Look at this, I think it's like a block party from the apartment. Oh yeah? They ran the electrical wire from the Look there. at that. Wow. <laughs> the extension cord is going all the way to the third floor. That's so funny. That's funny. Yeah, yeah. Wow. That's hilarious. Oh, they got outdoor dining here too now. Wow. Yeah, did they close off Pell Street to cars like permanently? It looks like, looks like it's still open. Oh, wow. Pell Street on this side, yeah. Yeah, it looks, looks like, like they did, wow. Wow, that's kind of awesome. Yeah. All the haircuts. Anyone need a haircut tonight? That's one of my spots. <laughs> this one is not the cheapest one. This oh, one yeah. charges you eight dollar base. Eight dollars. Eight dollars. Usually it's it will used to be five dollars and now it's six dollars for the cheaper ones. Yeah. But then goes to the eight dollar one. Didn't you do a video one time of like a <laughs> Chinatown haircut place? I yes. did. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Those basement haircut places, it's like always 50% haircut business and 50% gambling in the back. <laughs> <laughs> you pull aside the curtain and you'll see people just playing oh, games in the back. That's funny. I don't think it's the case anymore, but yeah. <laughs> I've never tried this place, the Sichuan Hot Pot. Oh, same. They're playing the piano in there. Oh, they are? Just, yeah. It wasn't there. Oh, wow. <laughs> Someone's saying hi. Someone's saying hi to me. Miss Deuce. Oh, wow. I didn't know if you could actually play on there. It's usually closed illegal. Oh, All right. Cool. We're going to go in. Okay. Oh. We're going in to Miss Deuce. Cute. Hello. Hi. What's up? Yeah. Okay.
Rachel. For the video. For the video. <laughs> I don't know what. I'll just do the other thing. Okay, I'm going to showcase. Yeah, I'm going to showcase. Yeah, I'm going to showcase. <laughs> I, I took piano lessons in China, like a couple, but I ended up not like following up, following up with it. And my mom asked me if I cancel these lessons, would you regret it later in life? I'm like, yeah, no, I won't. But actually, yes, yeah, I don't regret it. <laughs> it's just too much. Yeah, but my fingers, I don't know. I'm not really musically inclined. How about you? Did you take well, any lessons? I tried playing the bass guitar for about a month. I thought I learned okay, but like I didn't have anything to like forward to pursue. Like so. lessons? Did you take lessons or like? No, pursue? I just kind of try to teach myself. Oh. Yeah. T and wow. piano goes pretty well. That's pretty cool. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Ben plays piano. You always find an Asian <laughs> that plays better than you, though. Yeah. <laughs> It's really cool. Did you get your mooncake from Golden Fun Wong? No, not here. Oh no? More like Chinatown. I mean, uh, more like Flushing supermarkets, places like that. Is that where you got yours? No, I got it from the night market. Ah, uh, yeah. Yeah. Finish already? Yeah, finish. <laughs> The yeah. street is still all glasses stores. Ooh. Oh, they took this down. Uh, oh, wow. Look at that. But the summer, I mean, the winter is coming. Yeah. But That's cool. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Chalky. That was pretty good. Yeah. Chalky. Wasn't it another uh, Hong Kong cafe? Yeah, yeah, they changed the name. So it's still the Hong Kong cafe during daytime and at nighttime it becomes fancy Chalky restaurant. Oh, wow. They flipped the sign or what? <laughs> yeah, they changed the name completely. New That's management. That's crazy. Yeah. Wow. It's a Japanese chef that took over. <laughs> Pretty delicious. Man, that's something new that changed here. I never even noticed it. This one is OG by now. Mm. This oh. stand's been here forever. Chen's but, watch repair. Yeah, fixed watches and all this stuff. Yeah. You replace your batteries or change any watch band there. I'm so glad they keep the lanterns up all year round now. Yeah. I wish they were too. I feel like some of the lanterns are fading already though, yeah, in the sun. Sure. 
They did a lot to uh, bring business to Chinatown. Yeah. This is like the most Chinatown street ever. <laughs> I think so. This block. There's Chinatown ice cream factory here. There's Hokai over there. There's something. There's Mei Lai Wa down there. Um, let's go this way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh my gosh, I really love Mei Lai Wa so much. Every time we go, so delicious. The pork buns, the roasted pork buns, the pineapple roasted pork buns, the mm -hmm. best. There's still a line for it at six o'clock in the <laughs> evening, five yeah. to five thirty. They run out of the pineapple ones quick. Oh, yeah. yeah. They, it's not all cash only anymore. Yeah, they take credit card, but the credit card price is higher. That's yep. that's what I remember. Yep. <laughs> Wait, where's the kiosk? It's inside. It's inside. The line isn't even that bad. It looks like they expanded. Yeah. yeah. Oh, this is where we met last time, and the dragon was eating the cabbage up here. Oh yeah, that's right. During Super Saturday. <laughs> There's a great New York noodle town down there that opened up again. Oh yes! You went there recently. Yeah, There's I did. It's good. So good, so good. And someone recently mentioned that this is their favorite too. Oh yeah? Yeah. Oh. The guy said they like oh careful. Oh careful. Oh my gosh. Hi! Oh. Love the show. Yeah, nice to meet you. <laughs> Can't have got recognized again. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I have like a compilation of Kenneth getting recognized. Somewhere okay. on my computer. <laughs> oh he's gonna create a reel for you one day. Yeah. Everywhere I travel, I get recognized. The best recognition for you, well, my favorite, was when that woman gave you a red envelope. Like, oh, action kid! Yeah. Red envelope here. And the Super Saturday. That was, that was so sweet. That was a fun moment. The, the craziest part was when I went to Los Angeles, and literally my first video, within like the first five minutes, someone recognized me. They, oh. were, they were traveling from Texas. Oh, wow. <laughs> and I was in LA for the first time. Yeah. My first ever video. That's a sign. Time to move to Texas. Ooh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah, great New York um, noodle town. And a guy also like Xi'an, which is that one right there. Oh yeah. Yeah, they're closed right now. Xi'an. Yeah. They did a really nice job with a great New York noodle town. It's much brighter in there now and like more tables. Uh, good. Before it's all cramped. Yes, I like bright restaurants. Have you been to the Feast of San Gennaro this year yet? Not this year. No. Not yet. Yeah, I used to go maybe like every year in high school. Mm -hmm. And then um, and I ended up not going anymore because one year I had a bad experience. <laughs> Oh, oh man. No, that was actually college. Okay. okay. So that was sophomore year in college. Basically, there was one of those carnival-like games where you had to um, use a stick to uh -huh. stand up 10 sticks in a row. So, and then I kept putting down money. <laughs> and then I lost like over $600 for that one freaking game. Whoa. I know. I was so, so dumb. <laughs> I thought I was rich back then. <laughs> <laughs> What's the story with Joe Shanghai? Did it get any better? I don't know. This looks it? newer looking. Yeah, it did. I know. Bay culture. There's a bay culture here. Yeah. Oh. Oh wow. This was something else before. Joe Shanghai. Yeah, I think all of this is like a brand new building. Yeah, this is completely new now. I remember they used to sell like the uh, egg tarts here and. Why not? This is new. Now this hotel. Oh. Yeah. Well, this hotel I knew about before. But now that I'm looking at stuff closer, I'm like, wait a second, stuff changed. 
like the Hong Kong Cafe and Mott Street. And this, this is a, like a, oh, it's still the video game club. And like the bar in the front. Video game club? Yeah, yeah. OSNYC. What's that mean? Yeah, they have like video game consoles in the back. You just, you just pay like by the hour and you can hang out and play video games and tournaments and stuff in the back. And I think there's even like a room there where you could stream from to like Switch and stuff. <laughs> yeah. <That's cool. laughs> I know. It's kind of like an old school like internet cafe modernized. Yeah. Yeah. They probably have VR sets probably. Probably. That'd be fun. I used, um, I used to go to board game cafes. But, yeah. I guess there are a lot of changes to Chinatown, huh? I see, <laughs> yeah. That hot pot spot is some, some, somewhat new. Da Long Yi. Yeah. Sometimes, like, we go to Chinatown so much, but we go to the same street all the time. True. And now we're looking at it through a different lens as well. Even me, I'm like, whoa. I guess I'm noticing things a lot more because, like, I've been away from the city for a while. Uh -huh. That I'm like, oh, yeah. It did change. Oh, fluffy. so fluffy. Oh yeah, on Canal Street, there's like jewelry stores left and right. Yeah. Yeah. With high security. There's cause. Crazy things happen. Wow. It's a bad cause. <laughs> the old Jing Fong. What happened to the old Jing Fong? Oh, Let's wow. take a look. Yeah. yeah going on? They got like a generator hooked up to it. Oh. Yeah, I wonder what they're going to do with this location now. It's a big like empty space now. Another food court? I think like fancy I hope so. Building. Another food court? Uh, I don't think so. You think it's going to be condos? Yeah, most likely. Uh, Was this the entrance to Jing Fong? Hey, it's your fence again. It's what? Oh yeah. Hey. Wow, they're like already transforming it. Condos? It's gonna I think it might be condos. Oh man. I think it's a condo building, that's why people are so mad. Wow. Oh, oh well. Elizabeth Elizabeth Center. I used to go here. The plushy doll, dolls, so, and yeah, the toys. Super, super cute push top dolls. So, the center, and then also East Broadway Mall has a little bit of stuff too. And just go and look at the cute little figurines and the keychains. Yeah, but now. So much has changed. I know. Down there. Where we keep from? Oh. Well, what is this thing? This thing is like a. Crazy like generator thing. Chun Yang is here. Yeah, I think it's Rana, but I think it's Rana. There's Chun Yang tea. Whose favorite is that? That's mine. <laughs> yeah. yeah. I did a blind uh, bubble tea taste test. Chun Yang, I like the most. Yes, we were there with you. <laughs> yeah. Fun fact, Kenneth has a lifetime 10% off to Chun Yang. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, I still have the, the black card. Do you carry it with you or no? No, it's not okay. with me. But it doesn't work at the Chinatown location, what? they told me. Uh, yeah. Because it's not their franchise or I guess. not their I store, store. A it's wonderful work anyway. overseas. Or, uh, it's or like in LA or whatever, yeah. Wow. What did you, this used to be? Good question. A bank. Oh, it used to be Chinatown Bank. A bakery. You know what's completely new by, uh, by Lafayette Street? There's like a big new building there now. What's in there? It used to be like the Vietnamese uh, restaurant and 
something. I forget what's there now, but yeah, we can take a look. Okay. I smell the uh all oh, these. Oh wow. Dollar seventy five. Yeah. Hey hey. Oh my. Oh yeah. They're still popular, I see. People don't want to go to Wapang. <laughs> Come to Hey Hey. Whole Foods. <laughs> if you're ever curious about like a safe OG bakery, Taipan bakery would be the one to go. Yeah, they're good. They've been here forever. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and don't even bother changing the sign. <laughs> <laughs> same in Flushing. It looks yep. the same in Flushing. San Gennaro. Did you go yet this year? I did. I went twice already. Oh, yes, yes. Ye yesterday, I spent like nearly three hours in there. Uh, <laughs> it was crazy. Uh, oh, it's even it's even more it's busy now. <laughs> Man. It's so crazy now. I'm glad I did the video opening day because even then it was busy. Uh, Thursday. Yeah. But yesterday I went, I did a live stream in there for three hours and had sausage and peppers. I had gelato and spent a lot of time just like showing everything. What flavor gelato? It was a mint chocolate chip. We went to Little, Little Italy in the Bronx for the first time yesterday. Oh yeah? Yeah. Definitely Ooh. quieter than here. It was kind of tiny. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it walked... might be the same size though. It's like yeah. a two, three block radius. Okay. Yeah. It feels tight. Yeah. I'm like, wait, we're not going to talk on the wall. It's kind of Very crowded right here. I know. You would think Canal Street is like a big street. They should have like more sidewalk space. Yeah, at the end of this block, this green and white uh, top building, that's the new part I was telling you about. Ooh. Yeah. Offices or residential? And then the jail is all blocked off because they're going to knock this down and build a new one. too much money. I know, they should have just reused the jail <laughs> and renovated it or something. I still haven't tried this place. Oh, they have this in Flushing too. Oh. We don't make 40 it's right to next to uh, the fishball place. Oh, okay, I'll make sure, yeah. Duck head is $17.99 a pound, that's all. Yeah. Yum. <laughs> Don't judge me. I I tried a chicken head one time. Like I can only eat like a little bit of the skin. Like I don't get the appeal. Of, like yeah. getting a chicken head. head. Yeah. Oh, wait. Wait. Actually, I eat. Okay. I don't actually eat the head. The Just to clarify. <laughs> <laughs> but the duck is good. Yeah, to the right is the new part that I wanted to see. Let's go. Yeah. So she said. Wait, it might not be this fly. I think it's uh, the next one, Lafayette. One more down. But this looks new too on yeah. the top. Yeah. Yeah, let's I think cross. they painted the temple too. Oh, yeah, they did. For sure. That looks nice. You want to go that way? 
Yeah, canal and then one block down. I think this place is new, Spring Cafe. Vegan brunch? Yeah. Yeah, this is definitely new. We ate there with John Bar. Oh yeah? Like in one of his videos recently. They changed the table outside. Oh yeah, they did. I think they have to take down a lot of structures outside now. Because it used to be right here. Yeah, the city is cracking down. Oh. Yeah, I noticed that. There's not that much outdoor seating in Chinatown now. You can eat back inside the restaurant. Yeah. Yeah, it's this one over here. On the corner. Oh, yeah. Yeah, they didn't put anything in here yet, but man. It's a commercial building. Ah. Here's the next Apple store. <laughs> next Apple store in Chinatown. I'm curious how much they sell those eyes for. You know what they need? They need something here with a big public bathroom. Oh, yes. Because Chinatown desperately needs a public bathroom. Hi, you guys. Hi. Or you go to that um, Canal Street Market over there. Yeah, that's true. There. That's true. Yeah. That is true. Should we go to Baxter or Canal Street Market? Let's go to Baxter. That's what, to yeah. Okay. so awesome. Baxter, I like. It's got all the Vietnamese restaurants. Yeah. Sugar canes there, right? You know, oh, the sugar cane <laughs> place. We did a hide and seek video in Chinatown last time. <laughs> that was fun. You should do it this time. <laughs> you saw the last video we did? You think that radius was good enough or should we make it bigger? That was a good radius. It is, right? Okay. Yeah. Uh, no, I Especially don't now. <laughs> Especially <laughs> now because there's more people. It's going to be even more difficult. Yeah. That was a big radius. We should just keep it inside the park. <laughs> just the park? Just the park. <laughs> or just the street. You see me? You know, you know where you'd hide, like for sure? You just mix in with one of those gamblers in Columbus Park. <laughs> <laughs> You'll never be able to find someone over there. <laughs> one of them did actually try to do that. Yeah? Try to, the, like, really looking in and then the people, the older folks were looking him like, huh, what is he doing here? Because he didn't really fit in the crowd. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe we can play hide and seek one day. Oh, I didn't even see what the city did with this pothole here on Canal and Baxter because it was really bad. It was like one of the worst potholes ever. Like it was oh. going to sink in. At least they filled that in down there. Oh, That's good. I know. Oh, good. They did, they got rid of that orange cone. <laughs> He's only in that corner. No, it's over here. Oh, they did. Oh, good. They filled it in. Good. <laughs> right here. That was so bad. They used to have this in here. In there. Oh. my song. Yeah. Oh. Actually, <laughs> let me not scare you guys. <laughs> Time to say goodbye. I mean, that's the same song. Yeah, time to say goodbye. Oh, it is? Okay. <laughs> How's Ming, sing How's Ming singing? You like my singing? <laughs> Kevin doesn't hear us. We could just talk whatever we want. Oh yeah, you're right. Know. 
Oh, yeah, yeah, you can it. I can't You know what place I'd like to try one day? Hi! Good. We've been watching you stream for a long time. Yeah. You were at the Mexican parade today. I was. See you later. Have fun. Action kid. Action kid. It's me. That's cute. You know this Italian restaurant over here is supposed to be really good. Here? Yeah. Oh. I never tried it, but oh. I'd like to. This one right here? Yeah. It's, oh, it's not open. Oh, it's not open. They closed up. Wow. This Italian restaurant used to be here forever. Oh. I'm, I'm kind of sad I didn't get to try it. Darn. And many more other ones, I guess. I know. They just all come and go. Sometimes yeah. I tried almost all these places. Pho Nan Trang. Oh, Nan Na Trang one. Sugarcane. Hello. That's Ashley Kid. Yeah. <laughs> what? <laughs> like they're supposed to know me. We didn't hit up Wednesday this time though. <laughs> You have to try it, Kenneth? Okay. <laughs> Fine. What do you want? Oh, whichever one is good. <laughs> okay, what would you like? Watermelon. Watermelon. I had so, lemon last time. This place has a... This, oh, I think I'm going to my mic is oh. on. Okay, turn it back on. Yes. This place has a very interesting name. It's it's um, Sugar Cane Daddy. Yeah. <laughs> And then that sign is like a very photogenic spot. People just come here and take pictures. And they do a show. California? No, we're no, local. We live here. We're local. Yeah. But so much has changed, so we're just I know. learning it again. They make their drinks from fresh sugar cane that comes out of this machine. It's so delicious Ooh. and it contains potassium, calcium, magnesium, phosphorus, <laughs> iron, zinc, and thiamine. Every time. <laughs> How do they know that? It's from this sign. <laughs> yeah. I'll do the pineapple, please. Okay. You want, you want to do watermelon? Watermelon. Watermelon. I don't know which one. I'll do coconut, I guess. Coconut? Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Ooh. Wait. Do I need to? Okay. Do I need to add this to my video? Oh yeah. <laughs> oh no 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 no. You pay this time. Oh. Oh. Okay. Uh oh. <laughs> so I'm doing. Ben's in uh, trouble. <laughs> <laughs> But it's worth it with this. I'm doing a video where um, how much, what I spend in a week in New York. And this is only the second day. Yeah, so, but this time I don't, I'm not paying, so Ben is paying. Oh. I think the fact that you're filming this video makes you spend more. I know, no, yeah. that's why I have you. You get, you, you usually pay for gas and food. Oh. <laughs> that's how you get around me. You let someone else pay for stuff. <laughs> yeah. I have that little measure card. <laughs> yeah, right, so. What I spend, what I spend in a week. <laughs> Nothing, because my significant other pays for everything. <laughs> that's, that's the life I want. Oh, man. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, um, okay, I'm gonna go film my part, should I? Okay, have fun. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're just gonna wait here. Oh, okay. So you guys can listen to me. If I mess up, I mess up a lot. <laughs> okay. Alright. We'll be away. I'll be right here. <laughs> okay. okay. <laughs> have you tried to with me? Yeah. Oh. I've been here all the time. Oh, really? Yeah. Oh. I tried uh, young coconut, pineapple. I haven't tried kumquat. Oh yeah. Yeah. I don't even know <laughs> what that is. Is that a special kind of fruit? Uh, I looked it up. I don't know where it's from. Huh? I don't know what it's. I don't know how it is with the uh, sugar cane juice. Huh. The sugar cane is like really sweet. The other other flavors. It is. Sweet. Yeah. It could be tricky. Mm. Yeah. Watermelon would be interesting. Yeah. I like pineapple or anything. What did she get? Coconut. That one would be yeah. interesting. Coconut's too. good. Oh, they need to add an extra one here. Extra large. It says two. But <laughs> oh. Sugar cane daddy. That's why you're paying, right? <laughs> yep. You're the sugar cane daddy. 
<laughs> and it's like, you know, you come to Chinatown, you, you have a lot of options for boba, milk tea, whatever, all that stuff. And this is like a, a nice change. Yeah. You know, so, something different. Just as sweet and maybe healthier. Mm -hmm. I like, Juice of uh, the week is watermelon. I just know. Oh, yeah. I see that. I like boba, but there's so many experimental bobas. Like they have a milk tea version, and then they have the cheesy version. Oh, which yeah. I don't like the cheesy oh, yeah. version. No, yeah. I think Starbucks has been doing it. Yeah. Starbucks Maybe, is getting into boba? That, no. Oh, Dunkin'. Wow. Was it Dunkin'? One of the big corporations started boba. Man. Damn, I forgot what. Well, I think it was Dunkin'. Yeah, a lot of people are trying it out. Mm. I don't know how it is. You might have to try it out. <laughs> Dunkin' Donuts Boba Tea Review. Oh, heck yeah. Thank you. What is this? Hook us up with some um, actual sugar cane that you could chew oh, on. Oh, wow. Look at that. That's fun. Ming, look what we got. Pressing all the sugar cane out. I didn't even know you could chew on the sugar cane That's, like that. Uh, this one right here. Green straw. Thank you. Ooh. That's coconut. Oh, yay! I don't know why, but this place brings me so much joy every time I come here. What did you think you did again? This place brings me so much joy every time I come here. <laughs> Same. <laughs> I love this place. Yeah, it's like I walk through, you see the prison, it's like, oh, it's depressing. But by the time you come here, it's like, oh, that's nice. Everything is good. Yeah. And you walk down and you enjoy by the park. Oh, that's pretty. Oh, Thank that's you. Oh, that's the watermelon flavor. Okay. I'll do pineapple. Start. Look at that. Let's try this thing. Watermelon sugar cane from Sugar Daddy. Ooh. Tastes amazing. Yes. Yeah. Thank you so much. Everything good? Are you guys still doing more fairs or no? Wow. Oh, in Astoria? Oh. Oh, wow. Oh. I missed that you fair. Missed it. <laughs> I had no idea. I, went, I was here in San Gennaro. Uh -huh. <laughs> the funny thing, no, we haven't been to a single Chinatown one. That's why. At this one. Yeah, we haven't done it. I went, but it was so busy. It was so crowded. It was a lot of lines. Right. Yeah. You guys open in the winter too? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Brings me joy all year nice. round. Nice. Yes. Year round joy, <laughs> please. Okay. Oh, and bring it in, Kenneth. Bring it in. Mine's the pink one. <laughs> I'll put this in the middle here. Oh my goodness, yes. Thank you. La la la. Something, something for my summer, summer? Okay. Okay. I'll put it down. Okay. <laughs> Take your thingy and then let's drink it. Okay. All right. Oh, cheers. 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 Boom. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> oh, 
Oh, yeah. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> Drink healthy sugar. Is there an unhealthy sugar? Yeah, yes, yes there are. Processed stuff. The soda. Yeah. Oh, awesome. I'll send you guys the link when it's up. <laughs> what should we do? Take it. Let's take it. Yeah, I'll take it. We're part of the restaurant anyway. Oh, yeah. Oh, we can sit down? Do you want to sit down or do you want to do the park? Uh, do you want to eat? Yeah. Yeah, let's walk to the park. Okay. Yeah. Thank you. So Thank you. Okay, see you. Bye. <laughs> She's so nice. I know she is. We'll walk to the park and then wrap this video up. You actually taste the pineapple. I can't believe how hot it is in New York now. It's, yeah. I thought it was 70 something and then I opened my phone. I'm like, wait, it's 83. It's uh, shorts and t shirt weather. Yeah, right here. I know. The last stretch of summer. Yes. The funny thing is, I had to order all new clothes because I left my, my uh, short sleeve shirts and shorts in Miami. Oh. Hi. Yeah. Do you actually taste all the flavors? Like coconut yeah, and pineapple. Right? Yeah. My watermelon, you can taste the watermelon. so good. Wow. Do I crave this like every other day? <laughs> we need a machine ourselves. <laughs> I'm excited to try that sugar cane. Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe we we'll go to the wide open playground area. Okay. That's where we had. That's where we day. started our last year. <laughs> and here? Yeah, I think right across. Okay. Which one do you like more? Oh, they're both good. I think mine has like a nice kick to it. Mm. This you like is. Your lemon more or your watermelon? I like the lemon more. Ooh. Yeah, I had it not too long ago. Two days ago. Sour? No, not really. Did you play hide and seek here or were you hide? I don't know. Sit at one of the tables here. <laughs> you just tell me your secret, I'm gonna find you next time. <laughs> <laughs> or you hide in one of those bushes where the rats are. Oh no. No. No, no, not worth it. That's bad. Yeah. Hide in the bathroom. That's that. No one will find it there because no one will want to go in. Oh man! When we get old, this is where we hang out. Okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I was like, okay. Okay. I don't even know how to play the game. I don't know. <laughs> uh oh. Oh. Wow! How did that go over the fence? Yeah. The last time we played hide and seek here, someone was hiding like under the truck down the mini truck. Oh my gosh. <laughs> it was pretending he was sleeping under. We were like, what is that? Is that is that <laughs> we sat here. We sat here with uh, Hey Hey Roasted. Right here. With Kenneth. Oh, like, yeah, yeah, yeah. When was that? Two years ago or last year? I think, I think it was, was two years ago. Two years ago. Yeah. Damn, it was two years ago. I know, man. Oh. It's been forever. We started that live stream with it, with it on our shoe. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, and they're like, the, the people were like, are you guys done eating? <laughs> Let's go walk. <laughs> try the, try the thing, Kenneth. Alright, we gotta try. Okay, sugar cane. So, this one looks solid compared to the other one, which is like, broken up. 
The husk is like on this side. So. What do you do? You eat the top part? Yeah, um, you the eat top the part whole is super thing. hard. The whole thing? Yeah. Just not this part here. Oh, yeah, you're, I see. You're doing it right. Okay. <laughs> All you do is like suck oh. on it. And something it's kind of like celery. It's just yeah. like <laughs> celery, yeah. Extra hard celery. It's just, yeah, it's hard celery. It's sweet. Slow down. <laughs> yeah, you can't. You can't uh, actually bite through it. It's too hard. Uh -uh. You gotta really like just put your teeth into the top layer and let it like soak in all the sugar. Yep. Like so. <laughs> Yuck. Yeah. It's good. Good <laughs> thing we have Sugar King Daddy to do all the work. I know this is this will be a lot of work to get all the sugar out of this. Yeah. It's I kind of feel like I need to eat this like corn, you know, like nibble <laughs> yeah. it this way. I'll try it. Yeah, it's easier to do it that way. But still, there's no way you can bite through like all these fibers on the top. Mm -mm. You can only get like all the juice out. And um I think in Asia and China a lot of places they eat this with a, it's like a pastime thing. Just chewing it all day. <laughs> Some yeah. say it's good strength training for your teeth, but I'm not too your sure about jaw. that. Your jaw. I don't think it's supposed to be there. You walk around <laughs> in the village, just eat it. Everyone's selling it. Mm. I don't know. I don't really find this appetizing. It's a lot more work for it. It is a lot of work. work. Yeah. Yeah, good thing there's a machine to get the sugar out. <laughs> I'm done. Will all work? Yeah, you just gotta suck it. Hey, yo, that's what she said. What? <laughs> I'm done with mine. Everyone. Everyone take more so that we can throw this out. Okay, <laughs> you don't know you got more to go. All right, I'll take another one. Take another one. I'll take another one. Why not? Oh, there's two Let's extra one ones. All right. All right. Nice. Oh. Actually, this one's a better piece than the one I had before. Oh. It's oh, more, this one's this really hard. hard. I like that with celery too. It's like the end of the celery is thicker than the middle. I think this, these smaller pieces are harder because this this part is like yeah, it's very thicker. fibrous. Yeah. I got a lot of juice out of this one. Mhm. Mm this one barely had juice. Drinking it from the machine. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm done. <laughs> want this one? I'm all right. Chinatown for you guys. Chinatown for me. <laughs> September 2022. We'll come back October 2022 and it'll be different. That's yeah. true. And that'll be sweaty. <laughs> yeah. Well, it's the first time for me to eat sugar cane, so. Oh, okay. First time what? Eating sugar cane. Yeah, ah, like, like, that's cool. like, we're all like that. We're so glad. <laughs> Something different. No, you haven't. Okay, fine. Something different every every street. Yeah. Do something bold each day. <laughs> Ben had a, a series like that maybe four years ago. Every day he do something bold each day. Oh, I stopped on the third day. <laughs> <laughs> it was just an Instagram story thing, nothing serious. So I guess that's why he oh. didn't really keep up with it. My first one was eating ice cream at 6 a.m. in the morning. Oh wow, that's pretty bold. It's pretty bad. <laughs> it was the McDonald's ice cream, right? The cone? It was at home. I woke up over the fridge. I took it to work with me. Oh, goodness. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, uh, we're going to wrap this up. Thanks for watching the tour of Chinatown with me and the Bing Buzz. Hopefully you could uh, subscribe if you haven't already. 
hit the like button, and uh, we'll see you later. Thanks for watching. Bye. Thank you. Bye.